Yo, what up YouTube, what up boxing fans? Saul Canelo Alvarez, right now, is waiting. He's playing the waiting game, hoping Miguel Cotto beats Austin Trout, because if he does, he will uh, get that fight that he's, that he's dying for. A mega pay-per-view fight worth millions on Cinco de Mayo weekend. Canelo Alvarez hopes Miguel Cotto beats Trout so he can face Cotto and hopefully get a, a career-defining victory at only 23 years old. And right now this guy um, is being promoted like a boxing prodigy. As I've said in previous videos, he's being pushed right to the top uh, to face guys like Cotto, Mayweather, you know, the elites, right? However, he has ducked many other, you know, solid killers at 154 pounds. But in any case, I do believe Canelo Alvarez is a highly skilled fighter with power in both hands. And in terms of a prediction versus Miguel Cotto, I do favor Canelo Alvarez in that fight. If you really consider Miguel Cotto's career, I believe he is an old fighter. Like, forget the age. In terms of the wars he's been through with guys like Manny Pacquiao, Antonio Margarito, Joshua Claudi, you know, and you can even say Floyd Mayweather gave him a hell of a fight too and, you know, beat him convincingly. A guy like Canelo Alvarez who's young, quick, probably stronger, much bigger, and hungrier for that, for that, you know, the fame and fortune. I think Canelo Alvarez has everything to gain from a Cotto fight. And I think Canelo has the skills to beat Miguel Cotto. To be honest, Miguel Cotto is a highly skilled fighter. He's got a great jab. However, I have seen footage. If you look at the Jose Zito Lopez fight, Canelo does a great job of slipping the jab. He knows how to slip a jab. He can either, uh, you know, bend at the waist and, and dodge a jab by bending uh, backwards, or he can, you know, bob his head to slip the jab, and he knows how to do that, and he also knows how to throw a counter le left hook off of slipping the jab, and that's so key against a guy like Miguel Cotto. Um, you know, Canelo Alvarez also showed wicked body shots against Jose Zito Lopez. I'm, I'm not comparing Lopez to Cotto. I'm just saying if he brings the arsenal that he brought against Jose Zito Lopez, I see. Cotto having a very tough time against a guy like Canelo Alvarez, man. He also has a good right hand. You saw that against Cintron. And, um, you know, Canelo, Canelo Alvarez, really what he's missing is perhaps making adjustments. But he's an active defensive fighter. He knows how to block punches and really be have a huge attention to detail when a fighter's throwing his punches. So he can reactively block, and, you know, that's something you really have to pay attention to is a fighter's defense, whereas Miguel Cotto, he's open right up through the middle, and if he's not open through the middle, he's open when you loop your shots, as you saw Floyd Mayweather was able to make that adjustment and land punches against Cotto. So, overall, I see Canelo having an advantage, however, this is based on one key uh, of the fight, if this happens, Canelo Alvarez has to neutralize Cotto's jab. If he doesn't do that, then he's going to put himself in bad shape because Cotto sets everything up with his jab. He sets up uh, a right hand, he sets up his left hook, and he sets up the body shots. That's all off the left hand. So if Canelo cannot neutralize Cotto's jab, then the fight's a completely different story. But in my opinion, I believe Canelo Alvarez will do just that and either get a tremendous knockout victory or pull out a decision victory. I think Canelo has the skills to beat Cotto, and I think it's going to be a matter of time before he rises to the top of boxing, and then he will pick his spots very carefully and avoid fighters that can actually beat him. Because right now he's doing the same thing he did against the washed-up Shea Mosley. He's trying to fight legends that he can beat and bring his name up to elite level. And then he can pick and choose opponents that he can 
beat rather easily, much like Oscar De La Hoya did when he was on top of boxing. I believe Canelo Alvarez will do just that. So that's my prediction on the fight. I do see Canelo winning. I know, you know, a few fights ago, back when, uh, you know, Canelo had uh, an okay fight against Cintron and, uh, and, you know, Cotto off of the Mayweather fight. I actually thought Cotto would win the fight, but after watching Canelo improve fight after fight, I think Canelo has what it takes to beat Miguel Cotto. So for now, it is what it is, guys.